We do have potential for some strong to severe thunderstorms. Main threat would be gusty straight line damaging winds and also some heavy rain is possible, especially as we get deeper into the afternoon when some of those thunderstorms get going. Uh, we're going to have two fronts coming through. Warm front will lift through. That'll bring the batch of rain late morning. Then we'll have a little bit of a lull as we're kind of waiting on that cold front to plow through, and that's going to bring temperatures down. Tomorrow's going to be a cooler day. We're only going to get to about 60 tomorrow. So late this afternoon and into the evening, uh, potential is there for some strong storms. Dry right now. Uh, temps in the mid to upper 40s there at YSU. You see a pretty uh, large difference in temperature depending on where you're at this morning. Uh, we got mid 40s in Greenville up on Route 18 in Mercer County, the lower 50s down into central and southern Columbiana County. Election day forecast today, low 50s, cloudy for 8 a.m. It's going to be a cloudy day today. You see rain risk jumps to about a 30 to 40 percent chance around noon. Deep into the afternoon, though, we're going to jump that to about an 80% likelihood as we peak in the upper 60s, and we'll see some of those storms moving through. There's the storm right now, and as we mentioned, two fronts. Uh, the warm front will lift through first, and then we'll be followed by the cold front. You can see right around the area, low pressure uh, around the St. Louis area. They're already getting some uh, thunderstorms uh, getting going and some thunder already in Indiana and Illinois. So as we push future casts forward, you see right around noon, that's a good chance for some of those isolated showers. And then we're going to see that break in between uh, 3 and 5 o'clock, but then we'll see some of those thunderstorms as the cold front now doing its thing, grabbing all that warm, moist air and wringing it out like a rag. So that's where we could see some of the heavier downpours. And those thunderstorms uh, could be strong all the way until about uh, 1 o'clock in the morning before things start to calm. As the front clears, conditions get better. Uh, we also have cooler weather, a shower chance early tomorrow morning. Mainly that's before 10 a.m. And then we'll get off and running really nice day for Thursday. As you can see already into Friday and Friday night, we're expecting another system to move through. So rainfall easily could top out at over an inch. Isolated pockets could even see higher amounts. So potentials there for some ponding on roadways. So for your election day, upper 60s, often on rain showers starting up around mid morning to late morning. And we'll see again some of those storms this afternoon. This evening could be strong to severe. Uh, 50 for tonight's low and seven day forecast. Those early showers wrap up. Nice day Thursday. Rain showers return Friday, Friday night into Saturday. Could still have a lingering shower. So uh, going to be beautiful though. Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. Have a nice stretch of some dry days and temperatures moving into the mid 70s by next Tuesday.